everything is gonna be fine. Oh, I don't know, girls. Another day has passed and nothing. We still haven't found Donna. Diana, I mean, they're all at the police now. I mean, think about it. Maybe someone will admit something. I'm sure Donna will turn up. Girls, I really hope so, but neither our searches nor our announcements or the police have helped so far. Girls, I was at the police. They were asking me about Donna, and they were smiling a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Funny, Zhuzha. Diana, Zhuzha's just trying to cheer you up. Look, I'm sure Donna will turn up, and she'll be just fine. I really hope so, girls. I really hope. Look, guys. Thomas, you were mumbling. You couldn't answer a single question. Well, I was scared. Guys, I didn't even care. They asked, I answered. Hi, Hi Diana. Diana. Hi, boys. Well, do you have any news? Any information? What did the police tell you? What did they ask you? Nothing special. They asked how long I'd known Donna, if I'd seen anything suspicious, and if I had any conflicts with her. They asked me the same questions. You were silent the whole time. Well, I'm telling you, I was scared. I was stuttering. They asked me the same things, too, and they told me I was suspicious. Suspicious? suspicious? You didn't tell us this. Are you a suspect? I don't know. They just told me to come back tomorrow. I was also told to come tomorrow. I see. Still no news. We were also asked the same questions. Seems like the campers aren't planning to give the police any new information. Guys, we shouldn't expect much from the police. We have to find Donna ourselves. Yeah, we'd be better off without the police. So should I go tomorrow or no? Go! Okay, boys, get in. Let's go. We have to think it over again. Diana, don't be upset. Donna will be back and everything will be fine. Oh, I already heard this from you a million times. Yeah, so Donna disappeared from camp under strange circumstances. Maybe I should conduct my own investigation and I will find Donna and I'll receive a reward. Bob, what's going on? Why am I standing here? Listen, answer my questions honestly, okay? Okay. All right, how did you meet Donna? At the academy. I was with you. We met her here. Did you fight with her? Yeah. Did you notice anything strange? Yeah, you digging through the trash. <sighs> Do you suspect anyone? Yeah. Okay, who? Zhuzha. All right, where were you last Friday? Uh, in the camp. Your answers are pretty doubtful. What do you mean? Listen, Bob, the police asked me the same questions. Why are you asking me? I'm conducting an investigation. Oh, my God. By the way, you've got to help me. Well, you don't really fit the description of a criminal, per se. What do you mean, help you? Where is my leopard suitcase? All of our suitcases are here. No, my leopard suitcase is not here. Plenty, you're driving us crazy. You didn't even have one. Even if you did, we don't know where it is. We have other problems now. We were at the police station today. By the way, they're waiting for you, too. I'm so far out of here. I don't care about anything else. All I want to do is put all my stuff in my leopard suitcase. The runway's already waiting for me. Don't you get it? Blondie, wake, wake up. up. I'm fine, girls. The runway is waiting for me. Blondie, five questions. Speak truthfully. How did you meet Donna? Blondie is no longer here, and top model Blondie is leaving shortly. But first answer the questions. You can ask Amy and Mona your questions. Where is my leopard suitcase? Job, have you seen my leopard suitcase? No, no. <sighs> All right. Answer my five questions honestly. Hands off. Bob, you're a bad detective. It's because you're not helping. Okay, take these two. They'll answer our questions now. You won't get away with that. What should I do? Help me. Amy, Mona, where are you? Where is my leopard suitcase? Dear Diary, I spent another day in the counselor's room. My sister Diana is probably looking for me. All my notes were found by the counselors. I don't know how many more days I will have to sit here. But I won't give up. I won't go over to the counselor's side. Lulu and Lily made a huge mistake. They shouldn't have messed with me. I'm sure bunny girls will find me and save me. And Lulu and Lily will fly out of the camp. Oh, I miss my sister so much. She's probably out looking for me. Mike is leaving. Mike is a champion. Mike is leaving. Mm, no, I don't need gloves. Hey, guys. Hey, guys, let's just wait for Teacher Mike to leave, okay? How are you doing, Teacher Mike? Too late, Thomas. Got it. Hello. Have you come to say goodbye to Teacher Mike? Well, I'm leaving to pack my things. Oh, hey, guys. Teacher Mike, have you noticed anything strange at camp? Does it seem like something happened in your opinion? 
I mean, are you even still interested about life at camp? Yeah, something happened. Teacher Mike is going to the football championship. Well, Thomas was gonna go, but he flaked. So, did you see what happened to my sneakers? No, we didn't. Teacher Mike, I can give you sneakers. Thomas, your feet are size nine, and Teacher Mike's are 14. Teacher Mike, actually something else happened at camp. Donna went missing. We've been searching for her for three days. And today, all the campers have been called to the police station. By the way, Teacher Mike, were you at the police? Why should I possibly go to the police? I don't know anything. And, uh, by the way, have you seen my sneakers anywhere? No, we haven't. I'm shocked. Teacher Mike only has the championship on his mind and nothing else. Come on, it's pointless to talk to Teacher Mike. Yeah, let's get out of here as soon as possible. Teacher Mike, have a nice championship. Yes, thank you. Wow, sport really affects the boy. Yeah, although Teacher Mike is no longer a boy, all he has on his mind is football. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, are you sure nobody's seen my sneakers? Yes, Teacher, Teacher Mike, Mike, we, we haven't, haven't seen them. them. Okay, let's go. All right, Teacher Mike, good luck. We're off to find Donna. Thomas, come here for a second. Dang. Thomas, for a second. What am I supposed to do, run away or go back to him? Say goodbye to your coach. Oh. <sighs> Well, Teacher Mike, goodbye. I'll never forget our training sessions. Thomas, I'll definitely make it into the professional league. And then, I'll come back for you. You're my champion. But I thought I was done with football. No, Thomas, you're not done with football yet. Okay, Teacher Mike, I gotta go find Donna. Goodbye. Keep exercising. We'll meet again, Thomas. Dang, where are my sneakers? Stop traveling, son. Where are our boyfriends? Listen, girls, I'm thinking I'm gonna conduct my own investigation. I think I can find Donna. Good for you, but we're not interested. What are you gonna investigate? Hello? I've been telling you for 30 minutes that I'm gonna investigate Donna's mysterious disappearance, and I already have a suspect. So who's your suspect? Um, we're not interested. Girls, they asked me very strange questions and said that I'm suspicious. What do you mean? Well, they asked me when was the last time you saw Donna. I said I don't remember. Lauren! But I don't! Lauren, well then what do you remember? Tell me, I was simply asked five questions. Girls, this whole Donna disappearance just ruins the summer holidays. Maybe she didn't disappear but went somewhere, and here comes the police. Yeah, I agree. I don't like this at all. What if I'm gonna be blamed? Lauren! No one will blame you. But what if? Who else do you suspect? I suspect Smile and Timur. They're suspicious guys. First, they fought with the basketball players. Then, they became kind of distant. Your suspicions are odd, Zhuzha. Oh, boys. Hi, Hi girls. girls. That's exactly what I'm talking about. They didn't even say hello. Hello, Smile and Timur. Hello, Zhuzha. What did the police ask you? Oh, let's better go somewhere else. Otherwise, Zhuzha's gonna mess everything up again. Zhuzha doesn't mess anything up. Zhuzha, make, make us some, some lemonade. lemonade. All right. Girls, you know, I'm conducting an investigation. Detective Columbo. Ha ha ha. It's not funny. I'm gonna find out where Donna is and the bunny girls will give me a reward. Oh, sure, sure they, they will. will. Strawberry, strawberry lemonade, lemonade, please. And by the way, girls, I have a list of suspects. Get yeah, a strawberry, strawberry lemonade. lemonade. I heard you. Oh yeah, the first person on my list of suspects is... Strawberry, strawberry lemonade. lemonade. You're not interested at all, dummies. I don't know, everyone came in and out so quickly and they asked so many questions. Yeah, it was so odd. They asked, where were you on Friday? Are you sure you were with the girls? When was the last time you saw Donna? And they asked us who we suspected. Do you suspect anyone? So what did you say? What did we say? We confessed. Yeah, we told them the truth. What, what truth? truth? The absolute truth. Everything as it happened. Well, what happened? Do you know something? Well, what do we know? I mean, we said we didn't know anything. Phew, we don't know anything as well. Okay, girls, now we gotta go. Two more? <laughs> yeah, I bought the burger on the stock. Well, see ya, let's go. See you, girls. Bye. You see, they don't know anything. I'm still scared. What if the police come here and check the rooms? And what do you suggest? Do you want us to confess everything? What should we do, Summer? We've gone too far. Donna isn't going to come over to our side. All is not lost yet, son. We still have time. So we're not gonna confess? 
Well, not yet. What about the guys? What if they know something? You heard them say they don't know anything. I hope so. Don't hope, son. You've got to act. I'm scared. I don't want to lose my baby. What if he becomes disappointed in me? Here, baby. One gets disappointed, another one falls in love. Come on, son. Let's go. Yeah, easy for you to say. Now everyone will go to the police, give evidence, and then... Guys, stop. stop. I have a few questions for you. What kind of questions? Hey, Bob. You looking for trouble? We don't have time for you right now. Instead of doing this nonsense, it would be better if you would help us find Donna. That's exactly what we're doing. Basketball players are on the list of suspects. So, Kirill, how did you meet Donna? It seems like someone really wants to get into trouble. Let me talk to them. Bob, we're looking for Donna. Don't suspect us. Hey, easy! You should know that I'll stand up for my friend. There's one of you and two of us. Question two. Did you fight with Donna? Well, they're really trying to get into trouble. Bob and Job suspect someone else, not our boyfriends. We suspect anyone and everyone. Timor and Smile, let's go! Oh! Ew. We're having real problems and they're just having fun. Diana, maybe they can really help find Donna. Uh, I don't think so. Come on, let's go. We have to find the counselors and talk to them. Oh, they're ridiculous. Looks like someone watched too much TV. Seems like someone is wasting time on the wrong thing. So the first question, how did you meet Donna? I came to school and met her here. Okay. Did you fight with her? No. Did you notice anything strange? I didn't see anything. How's that? Just like that. Do you suspect anyone? Well, maybe Kirill. Where were you last Friday? W with the girls. All right, smile now your turn. How do you know Donna? I started dating Diana, and that's how I met Donna. Okay, second question. Did you fight with Donna? No, never. Do you suspect anyone? Not really. Where were you last Friday? With the girls in Timor. You guys are insincere. I can feel it. I've studied hypnosis. Man, you're a real hypnotist. It's not our fault. Let's go. Nobody's going to confess. Maybe we should change the questions? No, there are five questions, just like in the movie Crime and Punishment. So we have a crime, but we don't have a punishment. Exactly. We need to scare it all with a punishment. Your last chance. Donna, now it's time for you to give the final answer. Well, my final answer is no. Did you think it over? Maybe you're gonna change your mind. Donna, just think about it. We could be great friends. You know what, girls? We could never be friends. Oh, is this a charger? My charger. You're so dumb, son. I was looking for it all day. Mm -hmm. I wish you'd lose your head instead of your charger. My phone is turning on. Give me the phone, Donna. Is this it? Are we screwed? No, we're not screwed. The phone, Donna. Oops, a message from Diana. Now she'll see them back online. Uh, I'm scared. I'm going to go to the toilet. They're not going anywhere. Well, what are we going to do? Nothing. We found Donna. Are they going to believe us? They will. But Donna will tell them everything. They will believe us, not Donna. Girls, you're stupid. No one is going to believe you. Yes, they will. We found Donna! Son, just shut up and nod your head. I got it. You're talking again. You don't stand a chance, counselors. I know. I know that you did it all on purpose. You hid my leopard suitcase because you don't want me to leave because you're jealous of me. Absolutely not, Blondie. The whole time I've been here, I've never seen you have a leopard suitcase. You're lying. You are lying. I used to have a leopard print suitcase. Gosh, you're awful friends. Gosh, Blondie, you make so much noise. Just pack up your stuff and go. You're the one who's an awful friend. There, there's your real face. Are you kicking out your orange because of your jealousy? I think she's going crazy. I agree with you, Mona. Oranges, have you seen the counselors? In their room. Thank you. So should we go up to their room or wait for them here? Do you need us to go to their room? Guys, we're gonna talk to the counselors ourselves in their room. Let's go, girls. Buddy girl, stop! Prove to them that I used to have a leopard suitcase! <sighs> you used to have a leopard suitcase. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? I'm asking you again, where is my leopard suitcase? No idea! Donna? Donna? Where's my leopard suitcase? Girls, you don't have to get up. We're going to come down to you. Wee! Shut up! We already found Donna. You don't need to thank us. 
Diana, girls! Here's your missing sister, Donna! And please don't make up stories about where you've been. Just be happy that we found you, because it could have been someone else. They're gonna believe me, not you, girl. You can never Donna, where have you been? Been? We've been looking for you for three days. Phew. I was getting scared. Did you really think that Donna was lost forever? She was gone for three days. Donna, how could this happen? We've been looking for you for three whole days. Summer and Sun, I was in Summer and Sun's room. What? What? And there, and there come the fairy tales from her. What if they believe her? They always believe the counselors, they'll believe us. Donna, stop telling fairy tales. That's it, Smile. I'm never buying food on sale again. Look! Donna? Jeez! Yes, Summer and Son. You locked me up in your room and you wanted me to betray my sister and my team. Is this true? She's lying! Girls, is this true? You did this? No need to make excuses, counselors. No one is gonna believe you anyways. I think it's time for us to have a serious conversation. Uh, baby, you believe me, right? Will you stand up for me? I'm disappointed in you, baby. You know, girls, we didn't expect this from you. It's, it's over, over between us. us. Now it's getting scary. Now we're breaking up with you. Guys, the most important thing is that Donna has been found. And now we're going to deal with the counselors. Like the video, subscribe, click on the bell, and wait for a cool new episode. See you next time. Bye. Bye. Come on, Donna. Let's go. Show us where you've been staying all this time. Do things, do things.